Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Compliance Corner with John Hansen. Today is March 26th on a beautiful Thursday, and I'm here with John Hansen. John, how are you doing today? I'm doing great. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning to you. Okay, well, let's get right to it. So today's update, first thing we're going to be talking about is the statewide quarantine known as Stay Home and Stay Healthy is now into effect. And our offices are now closed to everyone but essential personnel. Communic your commission checks will be mailed. So we are now in quarantine. That's right. And that means stay home. Okay. So if you have to conduct business, conduct it electronically and do not leave your house. Yep, that's it. And we really can do business from home, can't we, John? Uh, well, we can do it electronically, mm -hmm. but we can't, we can't be leaving to perform inspections. We can't be entering houses. We can't be trying to obligate third party uh, uh, services to perform, uh, to perform services. Uh, mm -hmm. We've got to um, honor this quarantine. Okay, great advice on that. Okay, next one is consider writing and receiving offers conditioned on viewing and inspecting the property after the quarantine is lifted. Tell us more about that. Okay, so one of the uh, issues that has been brought up to me is, is just that. And so I wanted to just throw that out there to you as a possibility in doing your business during these two weeks that both for writing offers for your buyers and also when you're representing the seller and receiving offers, um, it's very possible to do it as a, a condition of the sale, the, the viewing and the inspection as a condition of the sale that would take place after the quarantine is lifted. Gotcha. So either the wording could be put into the offer, and again, that would be conditioned upon um, is the term instead of the old term back in the 80s, which was commonly used as subject to. So, um, so again, conditioned upon that uh, quarantine being lifted and also the 22 FM uh, would be used for that. Right, right. And that's what we're saying is use the 22 uh, FM. And I did see quite a few posts going, and going back and forth on both of our internal Facebook pages. Um, and so one thing that you had also shared is that you're a dues paying member, you're a realtor, and one of the privileges is having a free legal real estate advice to contact the legal hotline for your legal questions at legal hotline or, or hotline at wawrealtor.org, correct? That's that's correct. And so yesterday I want you to I want everyone to know that I received a question from an agent in the afternoon. I responded that that was a legal question that neither she nor I should be trying to answer that. And I gave her the legal um, hotline phone, uh, sorry, email address to send that to. And so by that night, yesterday, last night, she had an answer. Okay, and great. so um, that is a great service to take advantage of. It's free. Use it twice a year and you've paid your dues, your realtor dues for the year. That's fantastic. I tell you what, I mean, that's one of the services that, that they provide for us. So let's absolutely take advantage of it. Okay, John. So a lot of good tips for today. Everybody out there, make sure that you are now sheltered in place. We want you to stay healthy, stay safe, and keep staying active. John, you have a fantastic rest of your day, okay? You too. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Bye-bye.